How's it going, everyone? This is Trainer Connor, and you're going to be watching a Wi-Fi Pokemon battle video here. We're going to be playing on Showdown today, because I don't have that many battles saved up on my versus recorder right now on my Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire game. So we're going to be doing the underused tier today on Showdown. My opponent is going to be challenging me to a battle here, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's begin the match, alright? So you see, I'm packing a Hydreigon here at the start. Ampharos, Empoleon, myself, a Scavalier, and Avalug. I'm on the other side. I immediately go with a U-turn. I expected the Azelf to go with Stealth Ops. And I'm also thinking, okay, I can probably set up my Stealth Ops too, but he taunts me. I wanted to see if he had it. So he has it, and I'm like, okay, cool. We'll go for an Ice Beam, hoping to bring in the Shaman, because Shaman is begging to come in against Empoleon. But... I didn't work out too well, and then the yes, elf goes for the explosion. As I try going for another ice beam there, and my taunt wears off, so I'm like, okay, cool. Now I can hopefully survive this hidden power and go for defog. And I was able to get, well, I wasn't able to get it in the actual Pokemon games, but I was able to try this one out in Showdown, so that was kind of why I wanted to go on Showdown, was to try out some new Pokemon. Anyway, so I go back to the Hydreigon. This is a Scarf Hydreigon. Go for Earth Power. I didn't feel like going for a Dragon-type move because of Aromatise, who's a Fairy-type Pokemon. And just for Aromatise here, I have a Scavalier. And this particular Scavalier is a little bit weird. It has the Assault Vest with the knockoff attack like you saw there. Trying to knock over those leftovers on Aromatise. I really... Go for the knockoff again on the dual blade here. Knock off his EV light, and that's fantastic. Right here, he predicts my switch in the high dragon. Really good play, and then he tries to KO me with a Shadow Sneak. It's very weak at that range. High dragon is going to take it, and we'll take him out with a Dark Pulse right there. Now he comes with Magneton. That was a weird way of saying it, but he brought in the Magneton right there. Goes for Volt Switch, he expects me to switch out. Goes to the Shaman, finally it took him a while for him to bring that in. I go for Thunder Wave to slow him down because I know Shaman is a little bit faster. And then he went for the Leech Seed there. I don't want my health to be stopped, so we'll switch out. Go to Azelf, and then he went for Seed Flare and missed. That's a little bit unfortunate. But at the same time, I like that as well. We go for Fire Blast, we don't miss, and here I'm trying to put as much damage onto the Aromatise as possible, so that way a Scavalier can come in and revenge kill. But that didn't work out too well, so I decided to change plans because I knew he had Protect and I wanted to bring in Ampharos. That way I can set up screens. Unfortunately for me, I forgot all about uh, Dose Rio here. Dose Rio is going to go for Earthquake, outspeed me. I can't switch out because he has his ability to keep me in here. But that's fantastic because even though I lose my Ampharos, I can bring in my Avalug. And Avalug has Avalanche, it has Earthquake, Iron Head, and Crunch. It has Sturdy as an ability, so it can survive any one hit. It's really powerful, and it's really bulky as well. Unfortunately, though, Avalug can't take special moves that well, because Avalug's special defense is not very high. But that's okay. I still have my Assault Vest Scavalier, and we see Magneton carry the Choice Vest. I didn't see that coming, but... You know, it's fine. You, you, you try different items on different Pokemon. And this is what you get. You surprise a couple of people. Now we're reaching to the end game here. Because I forgot all about Sucker Punch. And he planned this really well. Because the rest of my Pokemon are low health. And that means that Sucker Punch is going to clean up the game. So we lose the match. But I need to 
Still, I enjoy the match, so thank you to my opponent for challenging me to the UU tier battle. I hope you guys like this video, and I'll have some more showdown matches here for you really soon, as well as Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire uploads too. Hope you guys enjoy, I'll see you all later. Alright, goodbye, trainers.